हेलो आई एम डॉक्टर सौरभ पटवर्धन फ्रॉम नंदा दीप आई हॉस्पिटल सांगली इंडिया एंड फेको ट्रेनिंग सेंटर इन दिस वीडियो आई एल बी स्पीकिंग अबाउट द फेको द फिनिशिंग टचेस सो लेट्स हैव अ लुक एट दिस केस पेशेंट हैज सुड एक्सफोलिएशन अ माइल्ड वन डेफिनेटली एंड ऑल इज सेट फॉर अ गुड फेको इमल्सिफिकेशन सर्जरी एंड वील शिफ्ट डायरेक्टली टू द near end of the surgery where i have completed fecal emulsification and i have placed the aisle in the bag looks nice and fine but surgery is an art and just like artist needs some finishing touches at the end we also can add something to give more value for our surgery so this is a case of pseudo exfoliation there are higher chances of intracapsular phimosis late aisle decentration late subluxation of aisle back complex and also the patient has some astigmatism which may need some correction so let's find out what i can do to make this surgery even better with the finishing touches with pseudo exfoliation it's better to avoid a smaller rexis like in this case you can see the rexis around 4 to 4.5 i want to enlarge it to around 5 to 5.5 so this is the technique that i use i use a titanium one as to make a tangential nick remember a tangential one not a radial one and then i use my favorite micro capsule rexis forceps over here and using the iol optic as a template i am just grasping regrasping the torn edge of the capsule rexis and uh, i am enlarging the ccc to the desired size here take your time the keep the anterior chamber well inflated during this maneuver and have a nice larger ccc which will avoid the chances of phimosis and that will in turn prevent the chances of decentration of the iol uh, i personally prefer to use capsular tension ring in case of pseudo exfoliation because this is a progressive disorder so in future there is always a chance that uh, the zonules may become weak and ctr i feel in turn helps in keeping the i o well centered and may delay the chance of subluxation later watch here how i use the capsule rexis forceps to place the ctr in the bag here and i use the sinski in the other hand to just guide it in case needed as a retina surgeon i have noted that if the i will back complex has decentered or subluxated and if the i has the ctr in place it's very easy to fix the same ctr i will back complex later on with just suturing and you can put the ctr even before the i will implantation in this case i implanted it afterwards so at the end i just nudged the i will out and this is the opposite clear corneal incision to take care of the points and five diopter against the rule of astigmatism that the patient had and that just finishes this wonderful surgery with the, all those finishing touches thank you so much for more videos subscribe to my youtube channel and also you can visit our website fakotraining.org.in for many more such videos thank you so much